Let's explore the new improved file creation system in PHP Storm 2016.3. In previous versions of PHP Storm, if you've tried to create a class which has a namespace which maps to a folder that doesn't exist, PHP Storm has just ignored it, errored, and made you create the folders yourself. This has been fixed in PHP Storm 2016.3. Firstly, we need to check that our app directories are configured correctly. To do that, we can bring up the settings pane and select directories. Here you can see I have a test sources folder and a sources folder marked. You can mark folders by clicking on them in the left pane and selecting what they should be from the top menu bar. As a point of note, in this Laravel app, the app directory is a PSR4 namespace. Therefore, I have to tell PHP Storm that its prefix is app. I have to also do the same thing for the test sources. Now, when I have the sources folder selected or I'm in any file inside of this sources folder, when I select to create a new file and PHP class, I automatically have the namespace set up. In this instance, I'm going to create a brand new file which is in a brand new sub namespace called example mapper. The namespace should be app mapper. Previously, because this directory didn't exist, PHP Storm would make an error and you'd have to create it manually. But now you can see PHP Storm knows exactly what to do and where to create the file and the extra folder for you. This also works for tests. When I'm in the file, I can use Command N to bring up the new dialog. And then I like to type unit and then select to create the example mapper test right here from in the pop-up. You can see that the dialog now knows exactly where this should be created and because it knows that the test folder is here it actually can create it right in the right place from within the file you're trying to test. It may not seem like much but this has been annoying in PHP Storm for a while and it'll certainly help my workflow when developing day to day. Thanks to Raphael Doms for suggesting this in Utrack, our issue tracker. Why not give PHP Storm a try? You can download the latest version at jetbrains.com slash phpstorm. Thanks for watching and let me know what you think.